So here's a new synthesizer I've been working on. It's all ATmega328P based, using a nano board, and it's got a diode matrix for the keyboard. Then there are four analog piezo preamp circuits and four slider potentiometers. The code is more or less done. Uh, it's certainly not optimized, but it works. Um, I may add more functionality in the future, um, but it is in a usable state. So it makes sound using the piezos. And then you can retune. Additionally, you can use the buttons in the default state to change the just interval um, between the press and the release note. So you can go 1, 2, or 2, 1 for an octave interval. And then you can subtract. So pressing this adds 1 to the numerator, and then pressing this adds 1 to the denominator. So you can get a sub-octave. So I've also added an aftertouch type thing, so when you do a long press like this, it'll fade out longer. Uh, it goes based off of your timing. So then you can also get the shorter short release notes. And then there are other modes, uh, well just one other mode right now, where you can add a bitwise um, or effect which does like a ring mod type effect and it goes like this one to this one in a looping fashion so it's very light on cpu um and then this is bit shifting the amount that it's going into it so i can make it more intense or go all the way back to none So now I'll reset those, and I'll show. So what you can do, if you hold down this button, is you can change the waveform. So then using the waveform switcher and the bit effects in conjunction, you can get a pretty nice variety of timbres. So right now, there's really not much to the synthesizer, but if you want to build it, uh, you can email me for support. I have all the documents on my site. Um, so good luck, and thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.